Welcome to EJM727. I've decided uh, to start my first broadcast talking about how to sign up for a Ustream account. You may ask me, why would I need a Ustream account? There's various uses. One, uh, if you have uh, people all over the c country and you don't have the money for a conference call to do uh, tutorials, you can uh, do live broadcasting over this and they can look at this at their uh, PC at their workstation. So they don't have to move and you don't have to lose productivity. Another thing might be is you have family all over uh, this planet and uh, they are at different time zones. Uh, you can uh, view, they can view this or they can view a recording that you are making. I am currently recording this so it can be played back for people at their own time. Now, the best, what I'm going to do is show you step by step how to sign up for your Ustream account. It's a fairly easy thing. And the next step is to set up your show, as they call it. If you give me a moment, I will move my software so we can look at my desktop. It takes a few minutes. Bear with me as I change the source and in order to do this I'm using a program called Manicam. There's various versions. Um, there's Cam Twist for the Mac and Webcam Max most people use. I'm using Manicam because it doesn't cost any money. Uh, Webcam Max uh, uh, runs $30. Alright, let's go to my desktop. We're going to go to the full desktop, and you now see my desktop. If you give me a moment, all right. When you go to Ustream, it's Ustream.tv, just like it's showing up here in, in here. Now to set up an account, you go over to this side over here where it says Sign Up. It's on my right hand side. You click on that button. and you choose your username your email address I'm just going to put something in here now this can be if you're doing this uh, business you could say real estate or your company name then your email address so you get information to you and I'm just going to put E E E M at E J M seven two whoops two seven dot com. Then you choose a password, then retype it in here, put your birthday right here, scroll up a little bit, enter the text here that you see up above. In this case it would be G J N 68 Z. You would then click that you agree on the terms. You can always look at the uh, terms here in the policy. And then you click on next step. Now I'm not going to do this. There's probably a few more steps on here that I've forgotten, but you will get an account. Now what I'm going to do is take you to my account that I already have in place. So we're going to go search to me. So in EJM 727. That's my account here on Ustream. I happen to be already signed in on my account, but you could sign in right there. Now the first thing you got to do is set up your show. I have already set up my show. What they mean by show is um, what you're going to call your account. Now this doesn't mean uh, each video you're going to do. That's a separate thing. So you would name your show. You uh, to put a picture on it. You would uh, hit browse and enter and grab the picture.
you would grab one of your pictures. We could grab that one. And then you hit open. And what will happen is it will put it off here onto this side. And whenever you're not broadcasting, that picture will be in place. Now, relative tags, that's something like keywords for those who are web designers. You put what's in there. You know, you can put in, I put EGM, EGM Consulting, but I can also put in what kind of work. What kind of show, uh, show description? I'm talking about myself and what I'm trying to accomplish. And then you hit save. And that's what will show up on your screen. So I'm going to sh show you real quick what mine looks like. I've done a little bit of uh, editing under the design already, so you're going to see some, some differences that what yours might not show up. And I'll show you that in another, another clip. I just figured I'd start small and get started. Now I use the background in there and right now this should be coming up showing that uh, I am uh, hopefully that doesn't happen to you. I'll be doing an editing in a minute to, to make sure. Make sure. Anyway, that's what I'm trying to do. Let me bring you back to me now. Of course, I'm running off my laptop, and running this many things may be causing a, a memory issue. So let me go back to source bring up back the camera to me so you can see me again hello now with minicam it has many things that I like one of them is flags I can put that so you know that I'm from in the United States I can put the time so you know what time it is where I'm at right now and you can put text in and that could be any message that you want so that's my that's my broadcast for today hopefully you found it useful you can leave comments on my Ustream page and I will be uh, doing more recordings as I get more comfortable. You're going to be watching me learn how to use Ustream effectively. There's many good sources for how to at Ustream. Uh, on the upper right you'll notice little uh, boxes of other people who are streaming. The first one should be Chris Perello. He has a very uh, wide uh, user base and he talks about tech. Another gentleman next to him is Best Techie and he has a lot of how-to videos. Hopefully you will find what I'm doing useful. Anyway, have a good day and I'll talk to you later.